And I, oh, I like that it's I'm gonna purple say something and blue. so daring. <gasps> something Why? so daring. Hello, everybody. It's the Dulce Girl. Thank you so much, uh, Shadow High, Rainbow High, for sending these for free today. We're gonna share all of them with you. Now, there are three in each of the sets, and we have Claudina here holla, with us holla. to <laughs> unbox and talk about it. So, we're just gonna open and talk. That's what today's video is all gonna be about these dolls. Now, let's dive in. <laughs> Since I oh, have we should it, swim together. We should okay. swim together. Okay. And the opposite. <laughs> okay, wait. Oh, there we go. All right, so there are three dolls in each one. This is a part of the Rainbow Vision episodes. If you have not been watching, definitely watch it. The episodes oh, are really, really good. good. I this really am really enjoying good. it. And this is Neon Shadow is the name of the band. And these are the three characters. I'm sure you've been seeing lots of pictures on Instagram, on social media about it. And then we also have the Rainbow Divas, which is like the glamour group. Very, you know, dream girls. I feel old Very school with this. Like when I see them, I see like old school glamour. Yes. Is what I'm getting. They 100% watch dream girls and said, let's make, let's make rainbow high dolls. Um, how do you do that so easily? Like I'm over here like, Everybody drags me for it, but I know how to open a doll and open a doll Epidemi quickly. You do. These boots are everything. Like, look at that. And all, these are, so, I mean, to me, with this set, both of these sets, they're very, very detailed and especially with the neon one, like, different. It's very different. Yes. I'm getting, like, she shops at a higher end Hot Topic. <laughs> A better hot topic. She shops at like I mean it's I don't, very Vivian Westwood. Yes, very like high end, but then also very edgy at very. the same time. It's kind of like 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 um seventies punk movement. Like the okay, I can see the punk with the plaid and studs and. Mm -hmm. I think her her quote on her bio is pretty and punk, which is like a reference to Bratz, but mm, um, that's cute. But one thing I love about the Rainbow Divas is they all come with little blow dryers that have R and H's on it. And I'm sorry, that detail, I'm living. I'm living for the detail. Like I really, I can't get over the little like detail to even the eyeshadow palette. It has little lines in the eyeshadow as if it was pressed eyeshadow. Mm -hmm. And it could have just been a little square. It didn't need those little lines, but to give that little extra detail to me, I was like, okay, someone sat there and was like, we're gonna add that in. And I like that a lot. Now the band does come with instruments. As you can see here, this one comes with a drum set and they all have the cat really cool design on there. I do like, well, yeah, you can definitely see a lot of the punk inspiration because like every single one of them have plaid, but then I also like that because it kind of keeps the band together. Like I'm yeah. like, okay, like the blue one has plaid pants, the pink one has a plaid jacket, like they, the series kind of goes together. Kind of like with the Rainbow Divas, they all have kind of like a mermaid silhouette and yeah. a lot of like shine to their outfits. So I can see like, okay, even though they're different colors, they're still part of the band. And I think, I mean, it's interesting. I've seen these dresses before. Like I'm yeah, trying to think of dresses, like this style. Dresses. Really, just because this is what's reminiscent to me is going to Santi Alley, and like seeing these dresses at Santi Alley or the mall, mm -hmm. and like um, it makes me think of Selena in the movie which when she goes to get the. Which to me isn't bad because like no. I, I like that. I like I'm like okay, I like this. Where they went, they went to go make their own dresses in Santi Alley. I bought many a dress in Santi Alley. <laughs> I bought fabric this week at Sandy Alley for stuff, you know, it's, I think they look very glamorous. I mean, I would have liked them to be holiday Barbies, like, you know, like the, compared to, like, the holiday doll, you know, because to me, like, I miss when holiday Barbies are really glam. To me, this is like giving me not holiday glam fully, but like just that oh, type cute. of glam. The Balenciaga boots? Yeah, and they're fabric. They're fabric. Yeah, they're not fabric boots. Fabric it's just something boots. else. Like they're actually stretchy socks. And it says shadow all over her boots. She has her little drumstick. She is ready to play. She's got the shorter acrylics. I think having the longer, like the twins, would have been cool, like you mentioned yesterday. Yes. That would have been an extra little something I would have enjoyed. Because are they the same length as Rainbow High or? Yeah. They yeah, are. they're the same length. Yeah. Her face, I mean, I love their faces. I love that their skin tones are, I can tell they're from the shadow world, but they have that little bit of color. I don't know, I like it. To me, it's a good blending of everything. Yeah. I mean, they, they look cute. This one, her hair is very soft. Her hair, she's just so beautiful. Like, this very is soft. such a beautiful your face? Doll. Oh my gosh. She looks almost like, kind of like angelic. Like, there needs to be a glowing light behind I her. I know. Just like a little, like, halo glowing. Even the earrings. I like that they've elevated, like, the earrings that they're using because they used oh, to always yeah. have those gems. And look at this. Like, these are, like, 
the, oh, I don't know if the camera's so picking up, but they're clear, like translucent hoops. And on the back it says anti sparkle. Oh, her hoops. Those are so cute. That's cool. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna see if Amazon has these hoops because they're really cool. And she has crimped hair going all throughout and it's thick. Like she has a lot of hair. Yeah. Oh wow, yeah. That's a lot. I really love her. Like she's so pretty. I don't know why they only lined the under part of her lip, not the upper. Isn't that weird? Is that are they all like that? Hmm. Might be a misprint. But... I don't know. Yeah. She only has the lower part of her lip lined, not the upper. So go figure, I guess. I don't know. I mean I don't hate her, but I just thought that was a little bit different. I would have preferred if they had, you know, the upper part kind of done to balance it. Unless that's a new trend. I don't know about. <laughs> just only line your lower lip only. Not, you know? not that I've seen. You're like, please don't do that in public. No. <laughs> I I think that they're okay, so out for you, out of the two lines, which one do you prefer? I mean obviously I really like the neon. Just because it's so different. Yeah. It's so different. Like we've seen and again, I'm not just in the glam because I love it. Honestly, out of all three of them, I think she has the best. I want to see her in her second outfit. What? And we can reverse them. So we'll see her in her second outfit and her in her oh, second outfit. Oh, do a little, okay, a little switcheroo yeah, thing. Yeah, so we can see, like, if that changes how it changes we Changes how we them. feel. Okay. Okay, so we gave them a style switch. I, I love her. That one looks better. I love her. She's like what Barbie wishes she could be today. I just, <laughs> like, it just... Like, it doesn't look edgy. It just looks great. You know, no, and I mean? that's that's what's crazy. Okay, so instead of I think when I add these shoes and this jacket, it'll look edgy. But I think just like this, like she just looks so like Malibu or yeah, like so she like down Melrose, Bob's so outfit. Melrose, like yes. I love that. This one looks a little. It's cute. Like it's not the best look. Like maybe eventually we'll take the hat off. But I mean, it doesn't look bad with her skin tone. Like this doesn't look awful. But that one definitely. Yeah, she looks just better. looks like she works in PR. Like, she's going to make sure your name is on the guest list. <laughs> I honestly want her like that now. Like, I'm I know, it's it, so cute. I'm like, that's it. I need to buy, and the lipstick matches. I feel like the lipstick goes really good with that dress. Yes. Like, the lipstick goes so good with the dress. Like, and I didn't think that this would look good on her because, like, the hair is like, but then I'm looking at this and I'm like, why is this, like, such a fab look? I love it. I love it. It's really cute. She looks expensive. This doesn't look bad. It just doesn't... It doesn't pop to me. Like, yeah. it doesn't... Mm. I wouldn't opt for it. But I no. wouldn't look at this and be like, ooh. But I, I still wouldn't opt for it. Yeah, I agree. I feel like there's something missing. I, it just blurs to me, like, yes. the, the colors. Okay, it's the hair. And now look. We know it will look better without the hat. But we're not taking off the hat because this is my set. So, yeah, so we need have to, to take pictures it. for you. I still need to film. I'm borrowing these dolls because I have no idea what's waiting for me in Florida. So that's why I was like, I'm filming. I'm using your dolls. Sorry. <laughs> um, I don't know. I like that this doesn't work for me in this outfit. But her in the punk outfit looks better. Yes. yes. That's how I feel. Maybe in a different color since this is kind of too much in the pinky. Tone. Like if it was like a blue outfit or, um, you know, like one of the other Glamour Girls outfits, it might look a little bit better. Yes. Yeah. It's harder to make like the fantasy skin tones work because I remember with Monster High like that's how it was with their aesthetics too mm. it's like you can't really mix their aesthetics very often it'll look weird but it has to be the right tone yes whereas all of their outfits I think will work for any Rainbow High doll mm -hmm. like we could probably take her, this outfit and put it on the silver one we could take this one and put it on the gold one like I love that that is so beautiful and the little mesh in the belly right there mm -hmm. like that right there just looks I don't know just a little bit of detail really goes a long way I just love it Oh, I can't wait to open the rest of them. Like, they're just so cute. Like, oh, so pretty. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. So the <laughs> next ones, I, I realized we weren't saying their names. This one is, is it at, how do you say it? Aisha. Is that how you say it? Spell Aisha? Aisha, yeah. Aisha's no, Aisha funny. has an I in it. I've seen people spell Aisha with an You've I. You've never seen Aisha erotica? It's like Aisha erotica. Oh, it's like hers? Okay, because I noticed they spell the spelling differently than some of the other ones. Yeah, well, okay. yeah, but this is Aisha. Aisha mm. Sterling. And Which you said is a what? Uma Thurman. Is a cousin? No, sister. Sister. Aisha to sister. Robin. Okay. Because I can definitely see. Robin. I can definitely see the face mold very similarity there. And I do like. I actually like the sequence dress, but I do not like the feathers. <laughs> Little chicken feathers. You're not a fan of chicken feathers? I don't know why they keep using it. I didn't like it on the Natasha doll either. I don't, the feathers are just not working for me. I feel like doll feathers haven't, doll feathers aren't there yet. They haven't been made to the point yet where they look like real feathers. They need to get um, quails. They need to get little quails and pluck their feather. <laughs> 
synthetic feathers, please. <laughs> And then they have the hourglass The amount shoes. of glue they are using on the shadow ones, though, because look, there's no glue. Oh my the god, look at that! The amount of glue that they're using on here. They don't want anyone like to steal them. Open. Yeah, no, they said these are, will not be stolen. But the rainbow ones, go for it. <laughs> it's so hard to get these out. Yeah, those are really in. That's a lot of glue. This one's not so bad, look at me. Hmm. So it wasn't me, it was the box. Yeah, it is the box. Yeah, look, there's no glue on these. That's crazy. So again, we have the blow dryers, but in different colors, of course, that coincide with each of the dolls. Um, I think that one's going to be my favorite because I love the guitar. As soon as I saw the guitar on that one on Uma, I was like, Done. Can somebody comment what her name is a reference to? Uma Van Hoos? Van Hoos. I don't know. It sounds like something we should Van Hoos sounds like something. I don't remember right now off the top of my head. I guess someone's gonna comment it and we'll be like, oh, that thing, you know? Yeah. It might be some old punk reference that I'm just completely missing too. And if it was that, then I'm really gonna get them props. Oh yeah, and the heads aren't pinned in either. They didn't pin her in. The pink one wasn't pinned Which in Which means they hand put these in here. <gasps> That's really cool. They hand pick these ones to put in here. And then of course, fans that coincide with each one. Like this one's like kind of like a clear with a silver, no, silver? Yeah, silver glitter in it um i mean basic stands but at least they give us stands and i have to always give that to them and then of course here is the beautiful makeup chest like look at the little versace moment there the little lights around the mirror which are not functional i really thought they were because this is really heavy like i was really surprised how heavy this thing was i was really thinking the lights would work and the doors open up and there's little drawers on the inside of these so i really like that i love the makeup chest thing that it comes with and then here's her in all of her stunningness. Again, feathers is a loose for me, but everything else. The feathers don't look as bad on this. Like here looks better than this, I feel like. This one, no, but this one, like the feathers don't, maybe because it's inside of the gown, it doesn't look as awful. But she has a beautiful hair. Like that hair is very metallic. She just looks like rich silver, that clothing. And I, oh, I like that it's I'm gonna purple say and something blue. so daring, <gasps> something Why? so daring. You hate it. No, okay. no, no, no. <laughs> I, this is what I, I hope a fairly similar doll line looks like when they come out. <laughs> this is what I was expecting. <laughs> like very like, like, you know, like this is current all aesthetic, current, like very, yes, the leather hat's hat. Real. That's what I'm saying. The hat's real. Leather hat with like ah. metal hardware embroidery around the hat. Oh my the, God. Is this a B-Files reference? I know that this is a reference to something. It kind of looks like V files, but I don't know what it is. She is beautiful. That's my favorite. I the think pants, the pants, like which the, I um, love. They look like trip pants. Yes, like they are. I'm pretty sure they are trip trip NYC pants. And then just the, just everything about her is like you know I can only hope that other doll lines look at this and say like it's it's possible, like it's doable. Um, like even this extra outfit, like look at the jacket, like look at the detailing on the her jacket. Lips, her lips are like holographic. If you look at the sheet, like the and her paint little heart on her face, like these are too beautiful. I think the they're too beautiful. These are the like the people are not deserving of it. We're gonna end the video right now because you don't deserve to see these. <laughs> That's what I said dolls. yesterday. I'm like these dolls are not. They don't, the average consumer is gonna it's walk by this doll on the doll aisle and just be like, oh, it's a doll. I don't think they understand how no. good these dolls are like they are just they are not worthy of the excellence the um the immaculate vibes of yes. these dolls and i know people are always going to say the same thing right oh you're getting them for free no but look at them like tell, tell oh, me right oh, now you can't say that about these tell me look at these dolls that i'm hoping if rainbow high and michelle high are watching this that they sent me both sets at home but like the, the detail in them it's like care. who can argue what is someone gonna argue with these dolls Just oh they're ugly like, like how? how there is no how? these are like the even the, if you don't like the colors lines. let's say you don't like neon green let's say you don't like the blue purple Ugh, lack of taste but like you still have to give like the design like someone i don't know like I can't. and two separate pieces uh two separate pieces everyone look at that Look at how cute. I feel like if any other brand tried to do this, it would have been one shirt. Do we have black tape? Like electrical tape? I want to put black X tapes under her shirt. I mean, we like... can try to get some electrical tape. That would be really cute, honestly. I kind of like it without the sequin top. You just want her topless. I don't I don't like sequins. 
I that's where they get me with this sometimes. whole line. But see, I I like old school dolls, and all the dolls always had sequins on. So for me, it doesn't bother me. And I don't like earrings. it. What's the earrings? Oh, they're it's a lock and key. Oh, very like again today's fashion k-pop looking even though i know this isn't the k-pop band but it just there is a k-pop band coming it still gives me that little bit of like k-pop moment with that wow. let me get her out if i can i'm trying to do this not as aggressively as someone else because i'm not like that but <laughs> i'll rip her out no i'm doing so good right now you just cut her whole ponytail! I did not! <laughs> that only happened once during a Monster High video, okay? Where I, cut, I cut her thumb off. It's still triggering. Um, she, okay, but look at these bangles. They look like actual rhinestone bangles. Yes. For that type of tiny detail, to have that look of a bangle is really, really great to me. Like, I love that. And look at this little microphone. It, the head does adjust. Like, she just looks like she's ready to just You probably have to cut this out of the video, but this is what I feel like she's saying right now. <laughs> um, we say that and then don't play the song. I know you're going to have to put over royalty-free music, but this is literally what I see her singing. Like, can you, I just see uh, her like... She's beautiful silver nails. She does have a painted on ring, which again, that little attention to detail. The <clears throat> earrings again look just, I, like I don't have any complaints from the hair clips to everything. The only thing is the feathers. I can't do the feathers. The chicken feathers. Can we see her in her second outfit? The feathers just aren't cute. Aren't I cute. wanna see her actually in her outfit too. Yeah, I could see the, the, okay, blue. the blue, I think is gonna complement her hair really well. She I is think. such a beautiful doll. That one's I, we're favorite. all over the place just because this is so exciting for me. Um, I don't, I honestly don't open dolls and feel things a lot of the times anymore. This makes me feel something. <laughs> like, <laughs> I am, I'm not here to, <laughs> to scream at the doll with you. That's what that's, it is. That's probably true. That's what, it, no, I feel the same way. When I put a doll alone at home, it's not the same emotion as when I do it with like, a friend or and some someone the next dolls to me. lately are just like there's so many that it's like uh okay but these are oh wow feel it it's so like quality it's so soft oh my god look at this has to be a Vivian Westworth thing because I think like I've seen this somewhere like the who inner designed lining that? satin oh this has look at it she has full underwear shorts in here that's the first time. Most of the time it's just a little strip of fabric. Mm -hmm. There's actual like lined shorts inside of the skirt. So even the chicken feather oh, the skirt. The pockets. The pockets. Oh, look at this little outfit. I like this. So it's like a little swimsuit. <laughs> From glam it's, to swim. Yeah, honestly, now I see it. From yeah, glam it to swim. It looks like she's like doing um, like a modeling competition. <laughs> Next up, Miss <laughs> I see. I know you're What's not a your super, favorite day? a superhero person. Oh, um, no, no, no. April, yeah, April 25th. April 25th. It's not too hot. Not, <laughs> not too, too cold. cold. Um, I see her as Storm. Yes. From the X. Someone's gonna make her a Storm doll. I can mm -hmm. feel that because the hair is just so Perfect. silver, but not like cheesy, like silver. Like I, I, know, I like the tone of the silver. I do. Yes. I just can't get over how quality this jacket is. Like. Like it's lined and it actually, you know what this feels like? Very vintage moment, old school Barbie clothes. Like my mom's Barbie clothes from like the sixties that had the really like, I mean the Barbie clothes had like actual tags inside. It looks like Barbie inside, Fashion Avenue. But even better, honestly. Like it just really feels That's saying so, something. Yeah. That's saying something from a Barbie stand. And I have stand. a lot of Barbie Fashion Avenue, yeah. yes. <laughs> this is a Barbie stand. I, Barbara's not for me. I right? love Barbara but, still. Um, you know, she's going through her phases. Just like Madonna had so many different phases, Barbie's in one too. And you know, Madonna got out of some very dark <laughs> moments in her music career. She'll come out of this too. Barbie's not Madonna. Ah! <laughs> Barbie. <no. laughs> but Margot Robbie might save Barbie because I love those little the clips the that have been coming out. The movie look really good. That's true. I love this jacket. Do you think they'll make a doll? That's like so off topic. Do you think they'll make a doll? Of her? I don't think they will. Yeah. I feel like they're not smart enough to do that. Margot Robbie should do a Rainbow High collab. <laughs> After she does the Barbie yeah. movie? Be like, I'm jumping ship, you guys. Well, Paris did. I want to see just this. Oh, just the coat? Yeah, like like that. And I was going to give her thigh-high boots. Oh. Like Mila, so I can see what it looks like. Oh, oh, okay. Like she's like, 
out in the rain. Naked? I feel like she's like strong. <laughs> I feel like she you like go out in the rain naked. Like no, sometimes like there's been a time or two. I know. I just see this for her. Yeah, no. The I blue see a looks brief, good. a briefcase. I see her as a lawyer. I don't know why her with this coat. Who is she defending with this coat on? Like or prosecuting? I just, no, she's a prosecutor. Prosecuting Barbie for her crimes against fashion. I like the skirt though. I feel like this is something I definitely have seen so much at the mall and online. And I like how instead of it just being a little piece of leather there, no, it's actually a full leather skirt that, as you can see, your leather, you know, and they put the plaid over it. They didn't have to do that. See that? Like they didn't have to put two layers, but they did. They did. They but did. they did because they care about their product. And I do have a series four video coming out that we filmed last night. It's just not going to come up until after this video, but I still can't get over how good Mila's boots are. Like these boots are literally, this is again, Bob Mackie level of doll designing that I used to have in the nineties is now what I have here. And I just live. So let me put the, oh, oh, oh stretch. stretch. Oh Rainbow High needs to come out with accessory packs. I know they're coming yeah. out with the bags and they're coming out with the shoes. No. Which we need necklaces, I, yeah, bracelets, I, the, the shoes are okay. <clears throat> I wasn't. I'm not thrilled by it. I'm just like okay. But I, I when they come out with accessory packs, that's the day that life the world changes. Ends. For yes. Everyone. Okay, so uh, here's with the heels, ooh, right? Like that's that looks cute. Really good. It looks You're like she's going to a cute like little date, right? That looks so cute. Okay, she looks cute with this. I like the color on her a lot. And, and the studs pop. Like her skin tone is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Like I can't get over. I like how more. she is still, again, not wearing clothes underneath them. <laughs> She's a streaker. <laughs> oh, I love these heels though. The second one on Uma has spikes on it. So let me show you that while we're getting the other one dressed. I love the little spikes though. You can open it. That's cute. And honestly, I'm thinking about it. Like I'm thinking like Kim Kardashian. Like she would wear this and then oh, it would just yeah. be like taped. Like she wouldn't have anything under it, underneath it. Maybe some skims. If they want to make rainbow high skims. Yes, please. <laughs> yes. I'm surprised out. they haven't done that. A nude, a fully nude line yet. Hmm. Like beige or like. I don't know. Coffee. Look at that. That is so cute. The the baroque. Yeah, that's really pretty. They do a good job. Again, they I, I very rarely am disappointed, obviously, with Rainbow High. Just wow. Oh, see, so the boots I, look really cool. I want her to put me in jail. <laughs> like, I want her to... She is Johnny Depp's lawyer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, I can't get over, like, I don't know. Again, I know this is, like, all over the place, and we're just, like, literally ranting, but... No it's purses? Ha it's hard not... No, but they gave us the hair dryers. And, like, I don't mind. There's no tools. purses. I was just like, she looks so good with a purse. Oh, like, yeah, we'd have to get her a little, like, a bat. Oh, my gosh. That just looks so good. Now you need a bunch of these so you can stop. I know. I just, see, that's, and that's, that's how they get you. Yeah. And they're so fun to play with because there's but, so many pieces. I know. I and none of them are ugly. None of them are printed on. None of them are cheap. They're all durable. I like her nose. Like, something about the face looks more like, mm, to yes. me. I love that. I just, she looks I agree. very okay. haunting. Like she looks ghostly. Oh, they should turn into a haunted mansion doll. I could see that coloring with her. This is what Ari Hauntington wants to be. <laughs> like I'm sorry, but like this. Is like... I just can't get over again. To me, it's just the detail and like the story. Like again, I look at these dolls and I know, I know what they're giving us. I know what they're trying to say, and it's just I. They're and saying, even if you do it first, we can do it better. <laughs> I think that's what they're saying. <laughs> Just every, like, wow. That is Fenty so Fashion Show. That's what New that looks York like. New York Fashion Week. Mm -hmm. Vogue. Okay, honestly, so I've been watching all the ones for this year. This looks better than that. Some of the fashion shows. I was like watching, I was like, what, is, what are they trying to do? <gasps> what? You know her? Oh no. <clears throat> She's a beautiful doll. Like that. Yes, that doll, when I opened her, I literally doll. was like on the floor, like the socks, everything. It's just like, and I mean, for the price point that we're seeing dolls at, yes, the price points have gone up. Yes, I know that isn't great, but everything has gone up. And then to me, if things are going to go up, I better be getting something in return. And I feel like they are giving us at least the quality and vision that other brands aren't doing 
at that price point. I know, you know, everything, like you said, everything's going up. I don't need gas anymore. Amazon sells Rainbow High dolls. That's all I need now. <laughs> all I need to know is I can order Rainbow High from Amazon and I don't need gas money. I don't need money for food. We can eat crackers every day. The, the <laughs> Rainbow High dolls come with little forbidden treats, rubber <laughs> bands, plastic boxes. Uh, please no one watch this. No, we no. <laughs> <gasps> Okay, that's... Gosh, I love her like oh, with the love so aesthetic. Couture. It is. She Does looks she have so good. No. Who has a necklace? This one, but it doesn't match. Give this girl a necklace. She needs a choker. I think Robin. Yeah, one of them have a choker that we could use. Oh, um, yeah. Well, um, Heather. Oh wow. Like, look at that. <gasps> look at the steel strap. It's real. <gasps> oh. oh my God. <laughs> Nothing you say matters unless the cameras are rolling. Yes. No, these are better than the integrity. Yeah. The integrity more... ones have <gasps> like look the case. Oh, that is so cool. I think I have my gem dolls down there. I really want to show like the comparison of the guitar. The only difference is the the integrity ones have actual strings. Yeah. But they break. They break on the integrity ones. The strap on this. Like look at this case, it's real. Like I can't do this right now this is amazing to me as someone who has played the guitar before i literally am living for like if this was out when i was little the world would not have no oh there she goes hold on now she's ready now she, all the aesthetics she can pull yes she owns everything yeah i love see and i was all like i like i was neon 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 but now I'm like no. I love the Rainbow Divas now too. Oh god. The like, doll community wins because I'm leaving the doll community so I can become a doll stylist. I honestly, <laughs> I can like, see that. That looks so, so good. good. She just throws this on her back and she's like, alright you guys, let's I play. could see like a runway, like if they were to like again, like the punk yeah. era aesthetic, like throwing that on there, sure. Like I just again the detail on this, it's a real actual strap material. There's little clips that hook on. Did the clips let it come off? Yes, the clips can pop off the guitar as well. Her or Robin? That is so cute. I think, I kind of like her. Her, yeah. Yeah, I like her. Her eye shape is, I don't know. Her hair is, Robin's hair is a lot longer. And, yeah. And Even this when this is right out of the gel, this is going to be longer and yeah, fuller. Of course. But the fa face shape on this one just is really catching me. She has more of the sleepy eye, and she has more of the, like, very, like, yes. snatched eye. Yeah. <laughs> me sleep you snatched there you go <laughs> our eye shapes right there i, I just can't I get over how beautiful eye color that, i can't get over how beautiful that is wow they did above and beyond what i would have thought let's still oh i do want to show at least the other two dolls that we did open up on a live stream last night since obviously we're just yes. talking about all of them um these two now now looking at all these i you know we just break everything Those are my um, you don't need those. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> I just, She's still my favorite. You like the green one the best? Yeah. Her outfit, I don't feel like, okay, look, if I try to put that on her, it's no. not going to give what these two are giving. Yeah. But. I don't know. I love this one's hair color. Just her everything. And She's the makeup so is so good. to me. Like the, the socks that. with these, with the sweater. Is she just giving like, if this was an actual star right now, and even the flats, I, I love don't love a flat, but like this, I love. It it's makes actually sense. laced up, like right up here. It looks, it's the illusion of being laced up, but up here it's actually laced up. Um, That's crazy. She's, if she was a pop star today, like I would support her. And then this one just, I can't get over the hair, is this beautiful golden color. The curls are this beautiful bounce to them, very like Shirley Temple curls. I love the little cut in the stomach here on the dress, it just gives a little something out extra. This is just beautiful. Um, and I love the blush and everything. Like she just looks so great, so great. Now the green one isn't my favorite, but I do love the eyeliner on this. Like look how beautiful this eye is. And that's what I love about the green one is the skin tone looks like an alien. And yes. then the eyeliner really pops. I was saying that the eyeliner, it reminds me of LimeWire. Yeah. And I, I do you remember LimeWire? Yeah. I feel like she's gonna give my computer a virus and I'm gonna have a, Great, great. Uh, she music looks very on the like a hacker. Version. She could be a hacker. Yes. I, I yeah. see that aesthetic. I kind of see her like. Uh, my brain was kind of going. You said line where I was like, okay, hacker computers. Like she looks very like Matrixy. Yes. The colors of the Matrix. Oh, <gasps> someone put her in a Matrix outfit. Oh, Ainsley's outfit. Yeah, Matrix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, and that's what I love. Dolls and play. Right there, creative. that outfit on her. Yes, 
I want that. Oh my gosh. See, I'm going to need triples of all these. So. Oh, I can't wait. These are all of Claudina's dolls. So I appreciate you letting me borrow all these for this video of, of us course. ranting about these dolls. I definitely need triplets of all of them so I can put them in all these different outfit combinations that we've done today because all of them are outstanding, especially my favorite piece. Can I get the leopard coat? I want to show them the leopard coat really quick that comes with, I already forgot her name, the gold doll, Meline, Meline. Um, yes. Look at the lining on this coat. I mean, this to me is like honestly a 30 to $40 jacket for a doll. If I was to order this like from a custom site, which I have ordered for my ball jointed doll, like custom clothing. And I paid, I'm going to say on camera, $50 for one little jacket. This is really good. I'm not, and again, I'm not just in the one that I got because mine's lined with buttons, but this, this is good. <laughs> this is good. Like, it's so that. plush. Like, I want to sleep on it. It is very plush. The fur they use for these dolls is really good quality fur. Yes. It doesn't feel like cheap stuffed animals. MJ knows how to source some product. I know that. I just, I literally am beyond words on what I, I, I'm thinking here. She is so, they're just so gorgeous. And those are our final thoughts, is that they're right, just gorgeous. I have to post them out of here. <laughs> have a good day, everyone. <laughs> Thank you for watching, everybody. And as always, make sure to check out more content for me in the description below. Content with karma. Thanks for watching. <laughs> See ya. Thank you.